Ho, ho, ho. No, no, no is more like it, okay? I have had it up to here with your freaking fa la 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 las, your jolly ass freaking songs. Well, all meanwhile, I'm sucking your freaking candy canes. I've had it, okay? Enough of that. All right, we are done. We are not doing that again this year. I am. No, no. But Henry, it was so much no, fun last no. year. No, shut the fuck up. All right, we are not doing that. Okay, you were not. Th you were not there. Okay, you did not have to deal with the same shit that I did. Okay, you got to sit up there on your freaking throne. You know, your fat ass just enjoying whatever you wanted. You know, having whatever you wanted. Okay, you were a fucking king. Well, I was the fuck. I got the fucking boot. Okay, I had to lick your fucking boot. Okay, you know how much I hated that. I was going insane, damn it. All right, no, no. We're going to do something a little bit different this year, okay? You know what we're going to do? You know what? You know what? Hey, guys, get in here. Get in here. Wait. All right. Okay, yeah. No. Okay. No. <laughs> we're yeah, yeah we're going to see how you like this, huh? No. Oh, yeah, you, you like this. No. Yeah. 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 No. Yeah, get over here. No. 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 Here we are. One week to go for the big one. We are back for episode 68 of the McBeef Banquet Podcast. Mm -hmm. My name is, I almost said Miles, Henry. My name is Henry. And my name is I've Miles. I've never made that joke before. And this is Miles. Yep. We're, uh, we're hanging out today uh, <clears throat> talking about a movie that we watched this week, which is called Remember the Titans. Just kidding. Remember the Night. You also didn't make that joke before. Remember the Nightins. I didn't make that one, so. Yeah, we're here today talking about this movie. Uh, Miles, what did you think of it? It was on Peacock, so there were ads. I know that aggravated you a little bit. A little bit. It was, uh, it's from 1940. Yep. Um, Definitely an older movie. Starring uh, Barbara Stan Stanwyck and Fred McMurray. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. Um... <clears throat> I liked it. I really, I actually really enjoyed it. Um, oh, me too. Yes. Some, I will say, some black and white movies can be a little boring. Yes. Um, this one could be a little bit sometimes, only because it didn't feel like much happened. Yeah. Um, one could say that, you know. Right. It's not like audience audiences today wouldn't really, uh, you know, appreciate it as much unless they're, yeah. you know, they enjoy movies. I think like we I do. think I think my favorite part of it had to be the act. The, the actors in it i i agree i think that really sold uh, you mentioned the love story kind of like feeling that like that was authentic and i think a lot of that was due to yeah i just feel like they had a good chemistry if yeah it felt the ke it was the chemistry it felt good it just i think it didn't feel like much happened for them to fall in love yes you know and that's fair um and it's like and i feel like it was kind of the same case except on an even more extreme scale with um his girl friday because, like, that was a whole thing where it was just one night. And uh, granted, they had a history. Mm -hmm. So they were already in love. But still, and I don't the know. Dude it's was, just like, the, dude, the dude was nuts in that one. Yeah, that's true. He was like, um, oh, I'm going to fuck you. Uh, hey, that's the entire plot of the movie, yes. <laughs> yep. um, His girl fuck day. Oh, my gosh. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, no, I I absolutely agree with you on the acting. I think the acting was great. Barbara Stanwyck was I really, great. yeah. I, Barbara she, Stanwyck was phenomenal. Um, I loved her. I, I've, uh, have you seen her in anything else? No, okay. I don't think so. Um, I have seen her in Double Indemnity, and she was really good in that one too. So um, I can see why she's been in a lot of stuff and why she's a pretty big actress. So um, that's mean. Wow, wow, Miles! The fact that oh, you would assume uh, that I would call her that because I was trying to um, insult her is very much no. What, what were you gonna say? I have seen uh, the Thorn Birds, at least a little bit of it, and that's okay. like a it was like a limited series thing. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, I don't remember her in it, but apparently she was in it. So there we go. That's kind of a connection. Technically, you have yes. Technically, I have yes. There you go. On today's episode of Technically, I have. <laughs> we, uh, uh, yeah. <clears throat> she was also in Titanic as well, like the original from 1953, I guess. Yeah. Wait a second. When did the Titanic crash again? Uh, 1952. That's too. It's too soon. <laughs> Um, it's like 1920s, wasn't it? Uh, 1912, apparently. That is still too soon, in my opinion, to make I don't a movie know. about it. I mean, they still haven't made a good movie about 9/11, well, have they? Well, it's not like it's a satire, like you know what I mean. I don't know, like it's I don't know. 
It's, yeah, you're right, but... Yeah, I guess. I don't if you know. think about it, a bunch of people it, died. It, that is true. Um, yeah, I guess they are kind of, you know, if they're making a story out of it. Yeah. Like, yeah, that is, that is, I guess, a little, a little sus, but... Okay, whatever. Um, back to the movie. <laughs> yeah. Um... I don't know. I guess was there anything else that stood out to you? Uh, what was his name? Willie. Was his name Willie? Yeah, uh, Winnie the Pooh. He Willie? was Winnie the Pooh. Yeah. He was. I, I knew it. Did you? I did you actually know that? No, I didn't. Okay. I, mean, I I I did agree. It kind of sounded I like him, t- but I, I could, didn't know if it yeah. was. I don't know. If it was yeah, he him. voiced him at least in one movie. I think. There we go. So it wasn't like a huge amount. But still. He was yeah. Winnie the Pooh. Sorry. I thought we could recognize him. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you had such a perplexed look on your face. I don't know why. I had no reason to be. You were, you were perplexed. His name is Sterling Holloway. Perplexed. That's, that's Sterling what it was. Sterling Holloway? And he oh, played, yeah, yeah. Okay. he was in The Aristocrats, The Jungle Book, he, The Many yeah, Adventures done... of Winnie the Pooh. Okay, yeah, so he's, yeah. Alice in Wonderland, Bambi. Apparently he played a lot, of, played as Winnie the Pooh a lot. Makes sense. At least back then, probably not too much. Nowadays. What? What did you find out, Miles? He played in a show called Willy. Steamboat. Willie? I don't think it's related to oh, the movie. Maybe he wasn't. Maybe he wasn't. Willy is an American situation comedy about a small-time female lawyer who later moves to New York City to pursue her dream of it's becoming not, an actor. What? I don't know. Made it it up. doesn't. Oh well, all that came up when I did images was Free Willy. Free Willy, the TV show. Free Willy. Yeah, I still think um, Steamboat Willy with okay, Mickey okay. Mouse. Sorry, back to the movie. Back, back to the movie. Um, back to reality. Yes. Um, it was weird though. You know the the scene where they showed that that criminal. Like it was like um, the judge of the small town was like looking at the new the you know the wanted thing or something oh that ad. one little insert yeah. yeah it seemed like he was gonna come up or something like the I, whole point I, of showing him and everything and and i totally agree with you on that i feel like it was purposely placed there to um i don't know compare criminals yeah but like I, I or maybe know. they had planned maybe i don't know i feel like it should be intentional like everything on screen should be intentional but like i don't know especially if like it's well, and, and the thing about it too is like when I say that too, like that usually applies to like just like, like set direction, like art direction and stuff like that. A lot of the time, like when you're actually making a shot that's gonna go in the cut, like you, of course you're gonna want to set that up and why show that for a reason. So like mm-hmm. I don't really know why that was yeah. in there because it didn't really. Uh, I guess unless it was just meant to show us who that character was, that but was, they kind of said who they, he was. Yeah, I don't know. Um. Or maybe, I don't know. I guess I'd have to go back and watch it and see what other information was on that page because maybe yeah. there was something that we missed. I don't know. But I don't know. Um, yeah, either way. Um, <laughs> I thought it was really funny when she started a fire in the, in the uh, office there. Yeah. I thought that was good. Um, it was, good. was it just me or were those, those two guys really mean? <laughs> Absolutely, they were, yeah. Fucking assholes. It sticks up their butts. Mm-hmm. Oh, you like, city folk have no <laughs> idea what it's like to live in the, the old small town. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I know. <laughs> that was so cringy. Yeah. Um. <laughs> I now I don't know nothing about no city folk, city but folk. uh, <laughs> we gotta teach you a thing or two <laughs> about breaking the law. <laughs> and also the um, the character. What was his name? Rufus. Rufus. Yes. Yeah. Who was like his butler? I noticed that in the credits, his real name was Snowflake. Really? Yeah. No gonna, shit. Hold on. Let me look. Let me look. Okay. Well, I'm going to look too, so. Well, I'm going to look better. Okay. Well, I'm going to look it up too, just to double confirm. So, and not that I don't trust you. Oh, wait. It's just that I, I have a lack of trust in you. Yeah. But also no trust. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We've dissolved the trust. Um, you dissolve Fred the trust. Toons. Oh, sorry. Fred Toons is his name. Okay, Fred Snowflake Toons. Oh, so his name isn't. Was an American actor and comedian. He appeared in over 200 no, films. But isn't that... Okay, so yeah, we kind of agreed on was the part in... where he was playing a role that was a little bit... Um... He was not, okay. What? Uh, nothing. Um, continue. continue. Was a little bit uh, racist, one might say. The role was a little racist. I would, yeah. 
Um, because they made that joke in um, Key and Peele. Did they? That one. Um, I don't know if you've seen it or not, but it's like the clip where, uh, it was like a funeral for an actor, and the actor was playing oh, very yeah, similar yeah. roles to that. I'm sure you've seen it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And everyone's like really embarrassed right, by right, it. Yeah. Um. But yeah, no, we uh, we like that's that that's like the only example I have to tell. <laughs> Right. Is but, that one no, but like, real sketch? Yeah, no, yeah, right. Um, but no, I, yeah, it was definitely, um, yeah. Uh, I, no. I we could, we, yeah, we both kind of said that. Yeah. It definitely was, it definitely had that kind of, uh, those kinds of undertones. And, uh, mm-hmm. that was, that was probably one of the things I didn't like, obviously. Cause yeah. You know, concern, just con- and that's just because of uh, the time period, the times were, yeah. you know. Um, does it make it that okay, makes it but, better, but, but, makes, yeah, but makes it understandable why it was put Well, in. it makes sense, yeah, when you consider what year the movie was made. Mm-hmm. Um, but other than that, I mean, I didn't really have any problems with it. I, mm-hmm. I thought it was really good. Um, yeah. Like you said, maybe there's not a lot that, I guess, goes on, but... And I don't think I've... Okay, I don't think I've ever heard of another movie with that same plot. Yeah. Like, um, I can't think of another movie that's like that. I mean, yeah, I can't either. Um, maybe if you look at more stuff around that, that time frame. Well, even now, they, popular, like no but... one's remade anything like that with with um, maybe because it's not very realistic, I guess. Are you th- you like that exact same like plot thread or like kind of? It doesn't mean, have to like... be during Christmas, but the whole point okay. of um, I mean, I guess Christ- mean, like, Christmas is kind of essential sort of though. Where it's... Yeah. You, um, I mean, I guess uh, Bounty Hunter or whatever, I think that is. I haven't seen it, but I think Bounty Hunter is similar to that. It, um, I'm trying to remember. I don't, actually, I don't know if I've seen it. Uh, The Bounty Hunter with... Oh, no, I haven't. Gerald Butler and, um, yeah. I don't know. A down on his luck Bounty Hunter thinks he's seeing an upswing in fortune when he gets a call to bring his ex... His bail jumping ex wife, a reporter named Nicole by Jennifer Anderson. Milo considers the job an easy payday, but Nicole quickly escapes to chase a lead on a murder case. The former. Okay. No. Okay. So, yeah, That's not, not quite, quite, not what, quite what I had same. in mind, but. But yeah, I don't know. Um, Nothing quite similar in, in my mind. Yeah I, yeah, I can't really think of anything. I mean, maybe you can, I don't know, similar ish situations, but again, I think part of it too is um, looking at the times and like how that would probably be the kind of movie to go see in that time. Um, mm-hmm. just with that sort of storyline and how fast it moves so um yeah i, I can't think of anything i could either. see that being remade though i suppose i don't know but well again though it doesn't like have you, to be exact point for point well but know? like you said too though like it's just not a lot happens so i don't know mm-hmm. if it would be something that would be crazier stuff could happen <laughs> yeah, right yeah that's pretty much all movies now are is just i guess yeah they just ramp up with crazier and crazier stuff yeah that's true just to keep it entertaining for the two hours that you're there or whatever, mm-hmm. hour and a half. Yeah. But what can you do? Poor Klondike bar. Exactly. It was funny because, like, we were watching it and, like, we thought that, like, like so many times, like, the way Peacock works, too, it's just, like, with their ads, they just go right into it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and so, like, you just think it's part of the movie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But um, there weren't any, like, particular shots that, like, I felt were, like, like stood out to me too much there was like one maybe i think i mentioned and i don't even remember what it was so um it was like was it in the barn or the stairs or something they were standing behind something uh, i think you might maybe have, i don't know uh he was coming out into the hall or something like that oh and and there like, was like something right it, the initial framing and then they panned the camera I yeah think, and then it was like it was okay yeah. Um, I thought the part where he was like they were showing the popcorn him doing the popcorn and then it, and then it like cut to a, a farther far away shot you like that was no I didn't like it oh okay <laughs> it was I didn't I didn't like that was weird I thought it was a little weird they couldn't just cut to him just making the popcorn yeah it I don't doesn't know. have to show an up close shot of him making the popcorn right I don't know at least a zoom out would have been nicer I think than sure than just uh did they have zoom back then. Um, I think they did. I think they, yeah, I believe they did. Yeah. Um, like, it was It was definitely... Probably harder. Yeah, but, like, they... I feel like it was definitely possible, though. Yeah, um, I just didn't like the way it was just so, like, cut. I don't know. Yeah. That's just me. Yeah. Um, it felt more like a TV show kind of thing. Right. I think. 
the beginning was a little bit confusing i will say but like thankfully they cleared it up so you know and it makes sense um this oh is i think i know opening. oh yeah, yeah yeah where it was like all so of a sudden was, this guy is screaming yeah um He's That's like, Mr. Meyer, yeah, yeah. He's this guy's just screaming, Mr. Meyer, and, and then, then we were the laughing. This guy locking this yeah, woman up. We were laughing because we were like, "Is, is he gonna, is she gonna die?" Like, <laughs> <laughs> we met her for like two seconds, and then it was just, "Oh, she's dead." Uh, yeah, but no. They, it, then they explained it in the court. Case. Yeah, and they, yeah, they were like, "Yeah, they're not gonna get this, so let's make sure that." Uh... Granted, we were talking a little bit over it too, but still, <laughs> it was a little confusing. I don't know, but no, it was really good. Yeah. Really good story. So, I'd watch it. Again. I, I would, yeah, I would recommend it, and I'd watch it again, definitely. Yeah, absolutely. We need a feel-good love story. Come to it <laughs> for Christmas. For Christmas, yes. Good old Christmas love story. Um, have you watched anything this week? I have watched The Mandalorian. Have you watched The Mandalorian? Oh, yeah, yeah, we did no together. No shit, that was did. a good. Up, that, was that was a good episode. I liked it. It was kind of short. It was pretty short. It's only thirty minutes, but um, we'll yeah. last stand because you got the like the four minute credits, right? Yeah, four it's or six minute the, credits. The, the recap and the the yeah. entire title sequence and and then the episode title and yeah, <laughs> gotta add every single second, you know. And, mm-hmm, yeah, make it all count, you know. Stretch that's this, probably like stretch ten, this bad boy out. That's probably like ten minutes right there, just probably. With, <laughs> with just like with when with you look at everything, yeah. There's some music going on in the background, I believe. Mm-hmm. I'm, I'm just DJing a little bit over here, so yeah, um, that's totally it's pretty me. quiet. Actually, you should turn it up. Okay, yeah, you're right. I will. In post. Actually, turn it down. Blair, sorry. Some music. Um, um, yeah, it was it was okay. I, I don't know. It was fine. It was good. The episode. Yeah. I liked Yoda. Yoda was good in it. Baby sorry, Yoda. not not Grogu. Grogu. <laughs> Grogu. Grogu. Yogu. Yo, Yogu. What's up? What's up? Yogu. What's up, boy? Um, yeah, we watched we watched Mandalorian episode six or whatever yep. chapter 14 or something um do you watch any movies this week though it's uh, a good question miles have i watched any movies this week i have not had time to so no i have not that sucks boy have you what have you watched miles? uh we watched santa claus got run over with by tim Ranger. allen with tim allen oh okay we watched the first movie which how did that I make you feel Watch the first movie, which we haven't, which I haven't seen in a while. Yeah. I think we both haven't seen in a while. I was gonna say, has Connor seen it? <laughs> I mean, yeah, we've both okay. seen it. It's like, just been okay. a long. It's just been a while since I've since we've seen it. Um, and then we watched not on the same day, but we watched Santa Claus Two, which we have the both seen Claus? quite a lot. Is that the third one? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Something like that. The third one. Am I? I don't know. <laughs> the third one is the one with. Uh, Martin Short as Jack yes, Frost. Yes, I do remember that. Yeah, I remember. <laughs> What's this... funny is that's that's how I remember like his name now is because of that movie. <laughs> Martin Short. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. Not because of like anything else. No, it's just called Santa Claus Two. Oh, okay, maybe I'm thinking of something else. I guess. The I third know. one might be the Escape Clause. I think. It's possible. Yeah. Yep. Is it? Yep. Okay. And we're probably gonna watch that one soon. Although For the I podcast. remember, I no, remember wait, almost no. nothing about that movie. So there's a Santa Claus figure, and then there's like a, um, there's like a Jack Frost guy, I guess, played by Martin Short. But that's all I remember. Yep. I'm so funny. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, um, um, yeah. The, anyway. Yeah. Uh, Peacock. Watch. Remember the Nightins. Yep. Uh, Miles has seen nothing else. Looks like. Mm-mm. All right. Um, well, that's that. Yeah, that, that, that's that. There you go. Um, Let us know in the comments below if you've watched anything this week, and we'll laugh at you for watching that. Mm-hmm. I don't know. Exactly. It's going to happen. Um, so we'll just, might as well get used to it. That's the all end right. It. So the movie we're watching next week. <gasps> and you didn't tell me you were going to pick a movie. What a surprise. What's up? What do you got for us today, Miles? I picked... I've already seen that. A movie... That you haven't seen. How do you know I haven't seen it? What if I pretty have? sure you haven't? What seen What if it? I watched it this week and I just lied to you? Go ahead. Um, I was going to pick it last year for Christmas, but you didn't because I picked Tokyo Godfathers. Exactly. Yeah. It's Tokyo Godfathers too. Well, it? it came out last year. Oh, so it was didn't come out on time, or did you just? I just didn't pick it. I you just didn't, didn't have the nerve. Up, I just didn't end up picking it. Didn't have the nerve to. Um, to but ask I do. The, I, the it's an animated film. And I I've, love anime movies. Animated, I mean, not anime necessarily. And the movie looks like it has really good animation, in my opinion. Okay. Um, and it is called Klaus. Klaus. Yeah, is, yeah I haven't seen it. Yeah. It is uh, by, it's on Netflix. It's a Netflix film. Yeah. I think they own it. I've actually wanted to watch it. 
Um, yeah, well, yeah. now you get a fucking chance to. Henry you know what? Bitch. I'm going I'm to watch it, and the first thing I'm going to say is how much the animation sucks. Well, then you'll be wrong, because it doesn't look that bad. I don't know. I'm not, mm-hmm. I'm not like, the best person to be talking about animation, because I don't know animation. I don't animate. I can animate some stuff. You know, I can animate you to kick animate my ass. Animate this dick. That, too. Um, animate this dick to go up. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Going up. Going up. Have you, have you seen Sing Street yet? What? Have you seen Sing Street? You haven't watched that yet? I don't know what it is. Okay, we still we I gotta, haven't heard of we'll it. We'll watch that sometime. Not for the podcast. Sing but we're Street? We're going to watch it at some point. I like the movie. It's good. Sing Street? Yes. From 2016? Yes. What is this movie? It's on Tubi. What is and this? And Prime for free. What is this? It's like a. Um, it's a street it's about singing. It, they're in, it's set in Dublin, so yeah, it's a. Um, it was only came out in Ireland, apparently. Yeah, but it's here now. In it's cinemas, it's anyway. Here. It's a really good movie. I watched it in my film class in high school. It was really good. It does look good. Yeah, we'll watch it sometime. Maybe probably not for the podcast, but I'll show it to you, or we can watch it together at some point. We can, yeah. We'll watch that for our birthday. Oh. All right, cool. Uh, so Klaus, watch Klaus. I thought we were gonna mention like a guy named Klaus and be like, "Yo, so Klaus, what's going on, dude?" Like so Klaus, what's up? We gotta get like Cole or someone in here and have them pretend to be like Klaus, like their name is Klaus. I forgot don't... that was there. Oh yeah, no, don't you don't want those to fall on you? They're pretty heavy. I still need to get these put up soon. We'll get them put up together. He's talking about some. Um, they don't need to know posters. Us. We'll we'll uh, we'll let don't them worry. know when we get them put up. They'll know. They, they, they'll be able to tell. They'll be able to tell how, how shittier the episode the, is. The audio quality gets so much worse. Um, but yeah. Weird. <clears throat> um, anyway. Yeah. So thanks for listening. Watch Klaus. Watch Klaus. Be an idiot it's on Netflix. On, on Netflix. Mhm. Yeah, yeah. That's that. That's, that's the, it. I that's guess. The, what year did it come out? Last year. I said that. Um, okay. <laughs> we'll uh, we'll call it for today. Thanks for listening. Thanks for um, listening. Don't forget. To I'm not going to use that as the outro. Whatever. I don't know. Communism. Avoid it at all costs.